So they, I get a lot of people ask if they want me to, if they could help my rescue somehow. And I'm like, man, I can't think of anything because we don't have a facility, but like, you can come over here and I can use you as stimuli anytime. So any kid that needs this done, definitely come over here and um, we'll put you to work. <laughs> Promise we won't make you pick up dog poop. Yeah. But um, <laughs> anyway, so Derek came over. I said, we're gonna see if we can do handler transference and how he does with a totally new person he's never met. Um, and he went to, up to Buffalo, New York a couple weeks ago. Uh, went to Tyler Muto's uh, training workshop and he did pretty well with, with them. Everybody in there loved him. They thought he's a sport <laughs> dog, not really a pet. But um, what are you doing over there looking at us funny? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I know you're gonna sit down. <laughs> Roger. Right. Yeah, he gets a little excited. <laughs> no bite. Easy. <laughs> Here, sit. So grab his collar. What? See so if you can grab his collar and hold him still. Here. Like, hold him like this. Sit. There we go. Yeah. Ah. Sit. Good boy. Sit. And hold him tight for a minute. I know it. Sit. Good. Don't just like, don't touch him. Let him just Does it get a little crazy. Get a little crazy. Okay. Good boy. <laughs> they're holding firm with one hand or both hands like on his on his collar there and just holding still like a tree like be a, be a tree be a tree be a tree because the more you touch him the more he gets crazy there you go perfect good boy Good boy. Excellent. Yay. You feel how wired he is? Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Alright. Let him kind of... Doing good. Good boy. See if you can pet him. Like, do like a heavy hand. Sure. Don't just put like a hand on his back. Good boy. Sorry, I still hold my hand on. Him. Yeah, that's good. Now he's gonna eat that rock just because. Drop it. Thank you. No. Ah. Just sit. Sit. Good. Good boy. Yeah. I get it to it. <laughs> Rock. <laughs> Go put your by the rocks. This is what we're gonna do. It's like you toss the rock, I want the rock. Okay, now see if he can. <laughs> Roger. He He's he like, does. can I eat grass now? He eats everything. He eats all the <laughs> clumps. Would you quit it? Drop. Drop. Yuck. It's mud. Oh. <laughs> all right. Good boy. It just shows that it's not picky. Do what? It's not picky. No. Well, he doesn't need his heartworm until you have to eventually does. Good boy. Now he's ready for you to pet. See how he's like, okay, now I'm ready. Ah. Uh -uh. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. Alright. Good job. Perfect. Four minutes. Why is it four minutes? <laughs> Better than no minutes. That's what he was at before. Okay. So when you first met him, what did you think about him? Very energetic and happy and just like 
barking at you. Yeah, this very, no. like. Did you think he was afraid of you? No. You felt like he was what? Like just like excited. If, if if he hadn't been on leash, what do you think he would have done? I think he would have like popped kind of like this. Jumped enjoy. all the way. <laughs> yeah. Well, he's he does pretty good when the guys come over every Wednesday night. Um, at first, he'd try to get up on the counter and knock all their cards and stuff off, but now he just hangs out underneath them. But I think part of it is he's getting older, which is good. Older's always good. Puppies are a lot of work, but he's finally kind of getting out of that uh, stage. Okay, yep, just start walking back and forth. He's gonna be on your left side. What? Put him on your left side. There you go. And then just go this way. He's got a leaf on his face. And he'll eat it. Yep. Uh huh. Good boy. Okay. So you have a treat ready for him? Yeah. Say, dude, good boy. Have him do like a sit. No, like lift it. There you go. Now give him a treat. Good boy. Good boy. Here. Do another turn. Here. There you go. Let's see if you can get it down. Down. Good boy. Okay, keep walking. Heel. Let's see if you can get a sit stay. Sit. Oh, nope, sitting. There you go. Sit. And then stay. Put your finger up, like stay. stay. And then walk out past him. Or that works. Three. Say, come. Come. Sit. Sit. Good boy. All right. Okay. So, see if you can get a down stay. Come. Down. And say stay. stay. There you go. Uh, uh, uh. Go take him back and put him down. In a, in a down. Sit. There you Sit go. Down. Stay. Stay. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Ta down. Walk him back and help him back down to where he was. Sit. Down. And put your finger up like stay. Stay. Good. Come. Sit. Good. Good boy. Sit. Yeah. Just, he's sitting weird. <laughs> you can tell he's tired. See if Come. you can. There you go. Sit. Oh, sit. <laughs> See if you can walk him over there and put him in a sit again and then walk back, see if you can fake him out because he'll expect you to recall him again. But keep him in a stay over here and then walk over where you were and then go back and circle around him and then, and then release him, yeah. See if he'll let you do that. Okay. Okay. We're gonna see if he breaks this here. I don't think. Now go around him on the right, or the. That's good. 
<laughs> it's pretty good. Okay, I'll call him to you. <laughs> Sit. Sit. He likes that down. He just does. Sit. And then free. 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 Good boy. Yay. Good job. Yes. Did the obedience, what do you think about his focus? Does he like food? Does he like toys? He doesn't seem to be picky at eating or yeah, he wouldn't. anything. <laughs> yeah, he's not picky. Yeah, he'll eat a rock. Yeah, <laughs> or a rock. <laughs> Which he might just do here in a minute. Yeah. Um, so what kind of home do you think he should have? Probably one that might have a little bit of a larger yard because mm -hmm. it seems very active. He likes to run around. So, um, yeah, he likes the birds. Come here, Raj. Come on. Come up here. Come on. Up here. Yeah. Come here. Okay. Sit. He goes, whew, I'm busy. <laughs> here, sit. Because I don't want to sit. I wanna, I don't wanna, I'll just stand here. What do you think? <laughs> For you, I can get in or call to me, but he might not be calling you.
Roger. Come. Come. Right, come. Yeah. Right, come. Good job. So calling back. What? Calling back to you. Say come on. Come. <laughs> come here. Take the take the one you have and make it look fun. There you go. Roger, what are you doing? <laughs> There's two of them. Oh my goodness. I just don't know what to do with myself. I have two frisbees. One for both ends. Oh, my cup runneth over. Roger, you're doing excellent with the, with the fetching. a lot easier to pet after we wear him out a little bit. Um, come on. Come on, Raj. Let's go. Hey, come on. Oh, he's, I'm going to eat something. Good boy. So, let's see. Um, when we first got him, he was shaved down. Um, they sedated him to groom him, and they took off absolutely everything but his beard. Um, so, let's see. And he's green and filthy, because we mowed the grass last night. He's still <laughs> green. I said, I learned last time, don't bother washing him until the grass dries out. So, so we're going to see if, I mean, I can brush him. He's got enough hair to even to do the slicker brush now. Um, he's like, well, what is this? To do his face. I mean, we're used to doing his face. Look how green your face is. Just look at it. Oh, man. Oh, and we got grass all over it. It's probably to wash this brush. That's okay. grass time. <laughs> I'm going to bite your tongue. The eyebrows. It's pretty good. So, um, like his legs, he likes to fight it, but not bad. I mean, with me, he does. But these are kind of prickly, and if the dog doesn't have a lot of hair and you're not careful, you can scratch him. But I mean, look how fluffy he's getting. His armpits. How pretty boy. How you pretty boy. It's pretty good. You're better than... A lot of the dogs I agree. <laughs> so, yeah. So see if see if you can, um, as a new person, brushing him. I don't know, I got a little itch there. So we kind of just see if it lets you. Don't push too hard because you feel that these are. Yeah, it's supposed to go like one way. I mean, um, if you like push too much, it'll it'll impale him, but. So, like, if you just go lightly backwards on his legs. Ah, ah, ah. Oh. Pretty good. You know, Steve hasn't even brushed him. Steve's yeah, like, smell or something. probably. <laughs> says, I'm going to bite it. So, like, brushes, like, leg hair up. So that's usually, like, the hardest part of the bush now is their legs mat very, very easily. They get out, of course, the cherry trees are going to start dropping their blooms this week, the next week. Um, so that'll be fun. He'll be dragging that through the house. But um, 
<laughs> so see if he can get his front leg to match his other one, like brush it up. Words. Yep, of course. So look at this. So you can go home and go, Reese, guess what I learned? <laughs> uh, sometimes like you hold his hold his foot like this. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Here. I got this just in case. Um, yeah. yeah. Go for it. Good boy. You're doing so good. It's getting fluffy. Look at you. You get to be a fluffy monster. <laughs> grab his arm fit here and like like firm. Doing pretty good. Yep, yep. Excellent. Good boy. Like hold it hold it firm, don't let him kind of you go backwards or um I would like just do the top of his foot. Go back with my Going backwards, fluffs it. There you go. Good job. Good job. Look at you getting brushed by somebody you don't know. Good job. So if he goes like through a groomer, which you know the first time whatever groomer he goes to when he gets adopted, it's going to be a total stranger. So he'll probably do the the meeting or whatever. And um, he definitely needs his toenails done. If we were going to do that. And. Um, Let's see what these look like. I don't have my cheaters on, but he does pretty well with them. I don't know, you hear, you hear kids outside? No. Good boy. I won't have you do this. There's adults that are afraid to do this. But he's pretty good on his nails. That is kind of shocking. His back foot. Back ones aren't as bad as my front ones. Back ones are kind of worn down. So we try to not let him get too bad because he can use them as a defense we weapon. And then do a kiss one real quick. He's like it's starting to get warm out here in the spring. Good. Okay, we're going to show what he knows. I'm going to walk up. Let's go. Back. Wait. Breathe. Now let him get let him get all the way down to the if he wants to get, go down the steps. Or that's even okay. He's like, what do you got? <laughs> like okay, now bring him back in. Let's go. All right, snap mulch. Oh, new mulch. It's the bank. Come on. Let's go. Good job, bud. Good job. I know. There you go. Uh-oh. Uh-uh. Come here. All right, sir. <laughs> He's like, yeah. We need to work on that a little bit better. A little bit more. It seems as if, like, he's, I know that I shouldn't go out there, so I just, like, he knows, but I don't want to go. <laughs> <laughs> Those are my not. Well, that's the thing, is they're supposed to have, like, the threshold control. They're supposed to... You know, look to you for direction because you don't know what's on the other side of that door. There might be a dog on the front porch. Like, that's never happened before. It has. Back. It's happened a lot to us, actually. Wait. You're free. Good job. I'll try to close on his. Do 
they close the door? Yeah. It's all right. <laughs> I mean, if we have like some, if this is green, then we can uh, blend it out. out and then just look as if it's like some full house video. <laughs> <laughs> Come here. Ah, yeah. come here. Yeah. So it's a sneak. Say good boy. Good job. Yes, boy, you should. No. You just want to love this again. Yes. Good boy. Roger, you calm down when I get the camera out. Are you done? Are you done wrestling? The famous bean bag. The bean look at look at him. And Steve says he gets too wild on the bean bag. Okay, here he goes. He might start zipping around. He's tired. Yeah. He's like, whew. <laughs> So if you get on the couch or whatever, he gets a little crazy, so you have to kind of make him settle, like how you did earlier with the collar. Yeah. You know, they have to, say, grab him by the collar and hold firm and let him settle, and then he'll quit. Eventually. <laughs> Eventually. But he definitely thinks hands are gonna wrestle with him. And you just wanna pet him because he's so fuzzy, but he thinks that's wrestling. So eventually one day he's gonna have to go, okay, do I want petted more than I'm getting wrestled with? But he does nap with you though. He does finally fall asleep. Of course. Why don't you do this to yourself? He is cute. Yeah. I think he knows it. Yeah. Pretty sure all dogs do this, like, use it to their advantage. Yeah. Definitely. Tongue hanging out. So plausible. Yeah, he's, like, definitely tired. <laughs> You think, Rod, you like your new friend? Do you like your new friend?